What's up ladies and gentlemen, today we're gonna install the Strap Hino wheel chalk kit. I do wanna note that I currently have the Ericsson wheel chalk kit installed on my trailer. I've been using that kit for over about two and a half years, going towards three years now. I, I'll link my install video and also my review video of the Ericsson wheel chalk kit above me now, so go ahead and check those videos out after you watch this video. However, when opening the Strap Hino kit that they sent me, I definitely see some advantages from their kit compared to this kit. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and get this installed. Let's go. All right, guys, so as you guys saw, we got the Strapino wheel chocks installed on the trailer. Two things that really jumped out to me when installing these compared to the Ericsson's. One is that it came with its own hardware, which again, not really a huge deal breaker, but it's nice to have a kit, comes with everything. I don't have to run to the store. Definitely a huge shout out to Strapino for supplying hardware. As you guys see from the clip, there's definitely a huge uh, link difference, which again, if you plan on upgrading your tires in the future, at some point, the Ericsson's aren't gonna be long enough while the Strapino is gonna provide you with plenty of uh, link to strap down your machines so to me it gives you room to grow in the future so that you know you're not buying something and then within like two years like hey I love these things but they're just not long enough to tie down my machine now because I've upgraded to like a 36 or a 40 so that's kind of where I'm at you know it's like buy once cry once type of thing and also when I'm buying something I'm able to use it in the future and not just something that I can just use today that works and that's just another day hanging out with your boy PA PC catch my next one peace 